I mean, I've worked hard. I'm a plumber. You know, I work, you know, 10, 12 hours a day. Absolutely. And I'm, you know, buying this company, and I'm going to continue to work that way. Right. Now, if I buy another truck and add right. something else to it and, you know, build the company, right. you know, I'm getting taxed more and more for well, you're fulfilling, for you're fulfilling the American dream. So well, you're, here, but here's, 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 the, here's the way of thinking about it. Um, how, how long have you been a plumber? How long have you been working? Uh, 15 years. Okay, so over the last 15 years, mm -hmm. when you weren't making 250 you would have been getting a tax cut from me. So you'd actually have more money, which means you would have saved more, which means that you would have gotten to the point where you could build your small business quicker than under the current tax code. So there are two ways of looking at it. I mean, one way of looking at it is now that you've been more, become more successful. Through hard you, work. Through hard work, you don't want to be taxed as much. Exactly. I, which I understand. But another way of looking at it is 95% of folks who are making less than 250 they may be working hard too. Yeah. But they're being taxed at a higher rate than they would be under mine. So, so what I'm doing is, you know, project, put yourself back 10 years ago when you were only making whatever, mm -hmm. 60 or 70. Under my tax plan, you would be keeping more of your paycheck.